Here's the 0-1. Hard hit grounder set out towards short. Routine play for Sung Che Cheng, who throws on to first. It's low, but dug out by the curve first baseman, Mason Mar Catching us on the Curve Radio Network or on Valley Live, MILB TV, or today, the free game of the day on MLB.TV. We're glad to have you tuning in. Sung Che Cheng, the batter for the curve, takes a strike with us. Oh, and one pitch is just outside one and one. Yeah, I'm very excited to pick his brain about just the perspective of growing up with Mike Kessling during the pregame ceremony. It's the one and one pitch bounced. His other younger son. Two and one pitch, a swing and a miss for strike two. Found back rather into the mitt of McDowell. Sung Che. Three hits yesterday for the first time in an Altoona uniform. He'll make his way back into the left-handed box. Facing a 2-2 two and two count with one away. A scoreless game here, bottom of the second. Gary rocks and fires. Pitch is fouled back over the net behind home. Next pitch is grounded over first base sign. Right into the mid of Jalen Ortiz, who steps on the bag for out number two. You know, and what's beautiful about that number 21 sign they make reference to in right field and foul ball, it's that, their potential is, is there. Pitch home to De La Cruz, blasted on one hop to short. On to second for one, it's a double play. Chang, Glenn, and Martin turn the 6-4-3. Two away in the inning as Cody Roberts goes to third base. Well, Roberto, you talk about these memories. Pittsburgh native is a right-hand batter. Swings at this offering, hits a grounder to short, knocked down by the shortstop, Chang, who picks it up and throws to first. It's in time to get McDowell a close play. Up to second base goes Jalen Ortiz, two away in the inning. For McDowell, it was a well-struck ball there by the catcher. Right-hander Griff McGarry, two hits allowed. He has struck out seven through four scoreless innings. His first pitch to Sung Che Chang he is delivered outside for ball one. Chang, Lolo Sanchez, and Claudio Finol for Altuna. Here's McGarry's 1-0. Bunt attempt shown. A ball to first base in his first at bat tonight. Swings at this offering, hits a grounder toward the middle. Shuffling to his left, Martin's got it. And the shortstop throws from beyond the second base bag. Over to first for the first out of the inning. It is now Sung Che Cheng to the plate. First pitch is sent a long ways foul down the left field line. And you know Altoona has not struck out to one pitcher ten times in a the game. There hasn't been an opposing arm this year that struck out ten batters. The last time it was done was Gavin Williams, and that was last season. Oh, that's right. The Akron. 0-1, oh a swing and a miss for strike two. It was Gavin Williams. and Altuna back in April. Count now 0-2 on Sung Che Chang. You got to go back to 2021 to find someone who struck out 11 in a game or 12 in a game. It was the same pitcher. It was Cade Cavalli. 0-2 oh pitch home, a swing and a miss. That's the 10th strikeout today for Griff McGarry. As the Reading bullpen. Yeah, 23-year-old Baker. 0-2 pitch, grounds it on two hops out to short. Shung Che Chang has it and throws to first base, one away. Baker's been impressed. Pitch home is swung on and grounds it on two hops to short. It could be two. Glenn's turn is in time. 6-4-3. McDowell curve when... Henry Davis was pro promoted to AAA. Here is Sung Che Chang. He's 0 for 3 tonight. Pitch to the left hand batter is swung on and bounced over the mound. Cut off the shortstop. Martin's got it, and he throws to first base to retire Sung Che for the second out of the inning.